So let me tell you something about my best friend. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Welcome to evil. <laughs> this is stupid. <laughs> That's the beginning of the video. <laughs> I was just seeing how long we'd go until one of us cracked. <laughs> I'm just gonna turn it down a little bit so I can capture both the game audio and you guys' audio. Boy, I've been waiting to play this game for a while. I'm, I'm excited. Uh, what difficulty should we choose? Do standard. Remember how hard Resident Evil 2 was? That was that was, that was on standard mode. mode. <laughs> yeah, I know. So you want yeah, to keep doing normal. standard mode? <laughs> yeah, keep it in standard mode. Oh, because we're not we're not casual and we're not hardcore. We're gamers. We're not. I'm not. Shut gamer. up. Ooh, it's Shrek. Long ago, a young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father. The only movie work. starting with a storybook. But the forest. Oh, by the way, I'm pretty sure I can speak for all of us when I say we're all going into this blind. All I know is tall lady. Yeah, same here. And it takes place in a village, and you play as a dad, a disgruntled dad. It literally came out today. <laughs> Feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled mother's scary bedroom. What is this? This is Coraline, dude. Bone dry. Then the path. Look, death is you. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. Passing through the This is actually pretty cool. I like this a lot. The clouds loomed, and the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark weaver appeared, and with a click of his fingers, crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Come, child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself and smiled with joy. Did Across she... waters deep and <laughs> under the sea. Hoping a boat she found would carry her home. There he is, Andrew Ryan. But hunger's grip tightened and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared and offered and said, one of "Come, his child, I will take things. you to rapture." Come, child, eat your fill. So the girl ate and smiled. Is, with are we playing Little Nightmares Three? <laughs> it looks on, like it. She soon entered the forest's dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew angry and Ruh -ruh. some of the other monsters. Terror filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beast. Suddenly, a witch appeared. This animation's pretty fucking cool, though. There she is! It's her! I'll be right back. Okay. Gifts we gave, but more you took, she snarled. Well, it got so real. More in turn is due. In a blink. The girl was trapped inside a mirror. <laughs> Baby. There. Is it just me or does that baby have a giant fucking head? With the creepy story, she's only six months You know, old. actually a lot of babies have very big heads. But that... actually born, like before okay. fully developed compared to other creatures, That's... because our brains are just so big and our heads are so large that understand. it would kind of just hurt the mother too much for us to we come out after so that. She have to but that head is just like abnormal. There's nothing wrong with my memory. Oh, it wrong? just means real smart. I don't know, she just snapped at us. We're talking about how big the baby's head is. <laughs> But I'm not paranoid. I'm just cautious. Then, go cautiously take your daughter to bed. If I drop her on her big head, she has she has abnormally large hands. <laughs> she does. <laughs> what the fuck? Why is everything in this game abnormally large? It's okay. Looks right? down. Your mother doesn't want to remember. I can't blame her. Things haven't been the same ever since you got that big head. Did you say something? Nothing. I'll put her down. 
Ooh. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. Take her to the backyard. Bad wounding there. <laughs> Take her to the shed. Here we go. This looks like the Fallout 4 house. No, it doesn't. What the fuck? That was like 1950s. This is... Don't get too close to me when I'm cooking, babe. I got the recipe right here. Just put it in. Better put it down. <laughs> Don't me put it down. What are you doing, mister? Cooking, baby. I do, I do like this so far. This is pretty funky. Our taste in music's definitely improved over the years. You mean mine? Huh? Ethan Winters! Oh! you good girl. We'll have a drink together, all right? When is the... Oh! Oh, I'm not a fan of the first person stuff, honestly. Honestly, I think it it really fit for Resident Evil 7. Obviously, I haven't played this yet to know if it fits for this game. I just like the whole idea of third person character running from zombie. <laughs> I don't even know if there are zombies in this game. Vampires are basically just zombies, you know? They're human zombies. No, they're not. They make vampires. Shut up! I mean, vampires make zombie soups. Yeah. It's like Do I they? Said to your mom, that they make, so like, scary for you. huff? I mean, it kind of depends on the version. There's a lot of vampires. Aren't zombies just husks, though? Well, I mean, it kind of depends- <laughs> Get in there! Get in there! <laughs> it's bath time, little buddy. <laughs> Like, Name Fontaine. <laughs> just very similar creatures. One bound of vampires, and the other one's just mine. When you them. disobey me, I say, "Code Yellow." <laughs> there, <honey. laughs> she sounds like a seizure. Can I kick the ball? Oh! Interstellar. <laughs> what does that happen in Interstellar? Interstellar game design. Oh, <laughs> I thought you were talking about the movie. Shut no. up. <laughs> Shut up. Quit your crime with your big head. Oh, monkey. <gasps> monkey. The real baby. <laughs> well, hi there, little Rose. <laughs> Why can't he talk like, like monkey? Why can't he talk like that for the entire game? Why can't he talk like Boots from Dora? <laughs> what does boots sound like again? I don't know. I so remember cute. in the movie he was uh <laughs> He was Monkey. played by Danny Trejo. Who's like uh Danny Trejo is that prison guy. So did did he mean like she doesn't want to remember as in she doesn't want to remember being at that house? Probably. We probably should have watched the recap. <laughs> There's a recap that comes care. with this. I don't care. Basically, in Resi 7, Ethan's g g girl wife gets taken to Louisiana where she becomes some kind of weird thing. Don't you worry. And he has to go rescue her. She's been there for like three years. And now shit's gonna go south again. Ethan Winters, the only guy in history who can get fucking. Smack dabbled three ways from Sunday every five seconds. I bet his favorite holiday is summer. <laughs> How long before it's Ethan Winters become Ethan Summers? This already. Why do I even keep this around? And well, then you'll have Ethan Foreside. <laughs> what is this? Why can't I take him with me? Why can't he be my child? Bobblehead Larry. What does LCS stand for? Larry Bubble said. It's already not <laughs> the letters. Wait, what's the let I <laughs> He's a funny little man. God, this looks real! Look at this fucking car shit, what look at this fucking carpet. No it doesn't, it looks like carpet. Carpet's not real! Yo. I mean, for your perspective, it probably looks great. From my perspective, it looks like a carpet PNG. Yeah, that's <laughs> understandable. Can't even full screen this. Try to get more detail. 
objections the way to the out. Hello, wife. I've killed our child like you've asked me to. Is she okay? No, oh she's God. dead. No, she's dead. <laughs> <laughs> if you know what I mean. Oh, hands off, mister. <laughs> Just dunk your entire hand in there, Ethan. It's a local recipe. Wow, you've gone full native, haven't you? Hmm? Local wine. Her too. face yeah, looks after, different. After the farmer change. Keep sulking all evening, Her face looked longer in the last yeah, game. Man. Yeah. You really well, have probably it's because they aged worrying. now. I mean, it's only been like three I'm years. Finding you in Louisiana. That's Good so enough agency. time for aging. Chris moving us here. Military training. Oh, bread! Fast, you know? Fun! That's the most exciting you part. Get yourself a lady that'll treat you with bread. <laughs> Everything's gonna Seriously? Be Think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. Oh, bread. I just I don't understand why you are so. <sighs> oh fuck. Mia, get down. Oh shit! We should have eaten the bread. I told you. Oh fuck! Oh fuck! The bread! Oh! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Well, she got down eventually. Larry, I told you 2 p.m. You're six hours late. Mia. Oh, God. Go see the baby. Name is Fonte. <laughs> what the hell? Sorry. That would have been funny. That would have been one hell of a no. reel. What? You got a lovely oh. wife. <laughs> <laughs> he says that after he shoots her 17 times in the face. Sorry, I had to take down Mother Goose. I needed that bread, Ethan. That bread was mine. It looked mighty tasty. Oh, <laughs> Shut up. Jesus. All clear. Rose? You'll tell me to move. Why'd you turn off the? Why'd they turn off the lights? I don't get it. No one's here. Take him away. I'm guessing they killed her because she was turned into one of those Ethan. things. No. Could have been. That's probably reasonable. Oh. Oh. He didn't listen to me. <laughs> Baby's mine now. I'm gonna go put her down the proper way. I'm gonna raise them to make sure he takes you out when you're older. <laughs> that, that, that's sad. That suck. She's my slave now. Imagine getting your child kidnapped from you to later become the person who will relentlessly hunt you down and kill you. That would be a really good story, honestly. That would. I think that's totally ha happened before in real life no, wait no, no yeah it know. has Thanos. <laughs> hey doc no no that was the doc i want a divorce <laughs> hey now think positively all right we talked about this i know She's wearing the exact same outfit. Talk about anything else. She's got that teacher outfit. Yeah. It's not Rose that I'm worried She's got that coach a lot of coach, coat a lot of teachers wear. Yeah. Like art teachers. Yeah. We matter, Ethan. You matter. No, I don't. No, I don't. What are you silly goose? I don't matter. What are you talking about, man? What are you talking about, me? Come on, talk to me. Ethan don't matter. That's me, E W. Name of the work. I have to take this. <laughs> EW. Why is she mad? <laughs> what are they arguing about? I have no clue. They're, like, they're talking about how, how their baby is my little angel. <laughs> they're talking about how their baby is fine. And then they started arguing. Yeah, it's like the baby's fine. I just called the doctors. <laughs> you matter! The wife? Matter. Oh my god. She got mad at him for putting her and her child in front of himself. I mean, that's respectable, but... You shouldn't get mad over that! What the fuck? Usually people want that, right? Is that is that the guy? Is that Fontaine? I don't think so. Oh, no. <laughs> it's so blurry. You took my bread! Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose? Turn to a robot. Man, I just want to eat that bread. <laughs> what the hell happened to you? 
all the things I do for bread. The things I do for bread. Sanders. Blanders. <laughs> what? Can I take his phone? <laughs> no. My just... phone now. I don't have a child anymore or a wife, but at least I have a cell phone. I'll get a Tamagotchi. <laughs> I'll download Subway Surfers. I'll download Subway Surfers and fall in love with, uh, I don't know, Siri. The, f the, the policeman from Subway Surfers, remember him? <laughs> the one who goes, hey! Yeah, him. <laughs> that's, all, that's his only line. Where are we? Death, are you gonna speak or no? I'm taking in the act. <laughs> You're taking in the act? I can't see much. It's mostly black. It's yeah, I can't see much either. I'm just walking through forest, I think. Hold the flashlight up a bit. I can't. Ethan's fucking stupid. You're <laughs> supposed to follow the footsteps. Footsteps? Oh, you mean the the, the trail? Yeah, the, trail. the body trail. That'll lead me to Mia. No, no Mia's That'll dead. That'll lead to barbed wire. I'm hunting my uh, child. Fucking oh, idiot! Get ready to see a lot of fucking hand action. Oh yeah. Since they can't actually show Ethan's fucking face or any other his body, his hand is gonna get chopped off like 19 fucking times. Happened in the first game, it'll happen in this- Oh. Hello. I've never what seen a native bird before. Games? What? What is it with crows in these games? Also, I don't think you can show these. Ah, uh, that's not fine. It's a cartoon bird. You just said the carpet looks so realistic like 20 minutes ago. I'm staring at the guts of a dead bird. <laughs> oh! Oh, he's definitely gonna attract someone. Leave me alone. Goodbye. Remember that? Remember that scene from the White House? That one movie, The White House, where Robert Pattinson just fucking like decimated that seagull. No, I haven't seen that movie. Like this. Oh, hello. The seagull. <laughs> the seagull is like annoying him, and he just takes it and slams it against a rock like 98 times until it becomes like a little pebble. That's weird. Yeah. Ooh, fish. Ooh, fishy. Ooh, the fishing season's easy this year. This is quite the experience so far. I'm, I'm invested. They're building the atmosphere. Where am I? Oh, hello. Oh, by the way, a man or beast. It's a gold night out for a man or beast. <laughs> Death has no clue what we're talking about. <laughs> There's a. No, you know. We watched this old like. We watched this old like 1920s movie. <laughs> it's like a 15 minute long 1920s movie about this guy, his dad, who like, is, like this family that lives in the middle of buttfuck nowhere. <laughs> And there's like a, a frozen tundra or something, and his son, his son goes out and gets drunk on beer, and then gets like arrested or something, and he has to come home. And he there's a running- to his family. Yeah, there's a running, there's a little running gag where every single time the dad enters the house, he'd look out the fucking door and say, It's a cold night out for man or beast! And he gets decked in the face with a pile of snow. What? It'll happen anytime he opens like the door to exit or uh, enter. I don't remember the name of the movie, but I'll definitely I'll I'll put it on screen if he'll I can find it. <laughs> he'll just open the door and then he'll look towards the snow and he goes, "There'll be a fit night out for man or beast," and then they fucking splat to the face with a bunch of snow. And it ain't a fit night out for man or beast. This happens like 19 times during the movie. <laughs> It's Remy. <laughs> what are we making today? Get back here. It's me, Linguini. Oh, hey, little chef. You remember me? Oh, fuck. You oh. That must be the midget head chef guy. 
Skinner? Skinner? His name is, Skinner. is that his name? Yeah. 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 I don't know. I thought Remy set up a trap for you. He's trying to inherit the restaurant. <laughs> gonna drop another chandelier, man. <laughs>